So nobody cares. Please keep your weapons concealed. You gonna do something about it? You gonna make me? No. I'll just keep it out then. Seems to me like nobody cares except the nurse. Obey the rules and enjoy yourself. What rules? There are no rules. There's only... Where the fuck do I need to go? Behind the club. Once again, I could swear... I could swear I met with Nicolette before... Inside the club. Not behind it. Well... I'm re Yeah, I'm remembering now, meeting her behind it as well. I could have sworn there was... Oh well. Um, let's see. Let, let's actually explore the front. The front entrance. Um, okay, I'm remembering actually going through the rear entrance in my first playthrough as well. I'm gonna... I'm just gonna go through this one. Because, you know, there might be something over here. Huh? Massive explosion. Ah, it couldn't have been anything. You like the nurse, eh? The nurse on the platform? She's all right. You stay away from her. Camille is a good woman. What am I then? Bad? You sneak into places you don't belong without paying, eh? Am I right? A criminal. Give me the 300 credits or I'll call the police. I'll give you 300 credits worth of buckshot. Make me. No. You, you will pay. I will make you pay. Just try it. You just killed a rat asshole. I don't think I actually shot him there. So maybe he isn't hostile. Maybe he won't make others hostile. I don't think I really need to look at any. Yeah, these are the uh, same things from before. These don't actually lead anywhere, I don't think. At least nowhere new. No fighting. Too late. Busy night, huh? Have a good time. I love this place. You have to share. You sneaky swine. Pay the 300 credit cover or I will report you to the police. Make me. No. You, you will pay. I will make you pay. Hmm, I thought he might have had different dialogue. You sneaky man. No. Guess not. Well. Aha. Very nice. Just what I needed. Okay, time to stop fucking around. Wasting time. Would you let me save for fuck's sake? Wish I didn't have to press the quick save key five times before it decided to actually do something. Anyway, let's meet with uh, Miss Duclair out back. I was actually just about to say that I, I'm pretty certain that there's a matter of uh, leaving Paris for the next area after this uh, conversation. Enough talk. I do not want to know about your... She decided not to show. I am Nicolette. I will help you simply to make trouble for Majestic 12. It's true. They killed my mother. Do you know why? She was an Illuminatus. The only people MJ-12 has ever feared are the Illuminati. Stanton Dowd said they had fallen from power. How do you know Dowd? I met him in New York. A trusted friend of my mother's. Yes, the Illuminati are wiped out, but Paige still fears Morgan Everett. Where do we find him? One of my mother's many secrets. We'll have to look for clues at my family's chateau. How does Everett threaten Bob Page? Page was an Illuminatus. For him, intellect is the foundation of power, and that would make Everett his most dangerous rival. But Everett's the one in hiding. 
Both the Illuminati and MJ-12 believe that the most intelligent or enlightened human being will inevitably gain power, ultimately seizing the eye in a pyramid and creating the world for everyone else. Kind of secularized version of natural law. Page has a trained army to protect him. He is still vulnerable. Much of his power comes from secret laboratories, meaning the right person could reverse engineer his whole power base. Let's hope you're right, and that Everett is everything you say he is. So I was more or less correct. You do meet her in the club. I just remembered meeting her, you know, on the ground level rather than at the top. Well, there's nothing really else to do here, I don't think. Um, I didn't bother waiting long enough to see if the comments mentioned anything about there being anything I missed in the previous area, and I can't really carry anything more than anyway. So, let's go. Let's go. You trust the guy in the helicopter? That's Jock. Don't worry. He hasn't let me down yet. Come on. It won't be easy to find Everett. Secrecy is a matter of life and death for the Illuminati. Well, I can put some points into swimming. That'll be useful, obviously. Eh, because I'll hold on to the points then. I haven't been home since the assassination six months ago. I have no idea what to expect. Your friend looks impatient. Let's go. Your friend looks impatient. Let's go. Let's hit it. I had not wanted to see this place again. Why not? I was afraid it would be like this. The same. Not a stone out of place. You would rather that Majestic 12 had burned it down? I would rather... <sighs> no, let's go. Only in novels do places crumble to dust for no reason when their spirit is lost. Your mother? Lead the way. I no longer have a key. We must find my mother's secret computer room, where she did all her work. A place she kept hidden, even from me. A good place to start would be my mom's bedroom, upstairs. My mother and I were no longer speaking at the time of her death. I left home because she and her Illuminati cronies were always pushing me into things. I was a rotten student, but that didn't stop them from getting me enrolled at La Sorbonne. I was a stand-in for the world they never got to take over. Some conspiracy, huh? They couldn't even control little Nicolette. This place sure is quiet. Right to the very end, my mother believed they were going to stitch the group back together and rule the world. Pitiful, if you think about it. Like a senile old lady filling her house with the unopened boxes from mail-order sweepstakes. But my mother was remarkable in her own way. I overheard her tell Everett one night that she had calculated Majestic 12's private key. Right here, where I grew up, she was tracking a global conspiracy and trying to do something about it. She had a secret computer room, some kind of monitoring station. I heard her talk about it, but I never found the entrance. Even when we were on bad terms, I continued to deliver money to Silhouette because I knew how important they were to my mother's plans. I also wanted to help Chad. A group like Silhouette has a lot to gain from an alliance with the Illuminati in the short term. In the long term, well, if my mother had been successful, we would be trying to stop the Illuminati right now instead of Majestic 12. Where now? Dull place to grow up, huh? I'm so glad I moved to the city. You lead. Okay, let's get to work. Now, if I remember right, one of the uh, <clears throat> more unique 
things about this location is that the fact that um, I don't believe there's any sort of combat at all. That's not funny. Just breaking my way in. Just helping. That's all. So need no need to worry about hostiles. I'm pulling up the floor plan. An old summer home built during the Third Republic. It's been vacant since Miss Duclair's assassination. Hopefully these elegant rooms contain some clues about the Duclair family's involvement with the Illuminati. As I was saying, no, uh... The maid did all of the cooking, but Mom always picked out the wine. She was the only one with a key to the cellar. As I was saying, no hostilities in this area. At least not until the end. I just don't remember when exactly, if at all, any hostilities happen. And you're just kind of exploring the place with, uh... Nicolette. Funny, you know when I was a little girl, I used to play in the dumb waiter that goes up to mom's room. Amazing, I didn't break my neck. Talking about dumb waiters are completely safe. Mm, I remember there being something very important in the wine cellar, so I'll hold off on going there just yet. I'm gonna explore this whole place. Every inch of it. More fun that way. My mom had that couch flown in from Portugal. Exactly the same as what she could have bought at La Samaritaine, except that it was once graced by the bottoms of a royal family. This is a couch? It must be. It's the only thing she's. The only thing. The closest thing to a couch there is in here. I don't understand rich people's design decisions. Okay, is there nothing more to the ground level? I guess let's go up to the second floor then. The secret room in the upper part of the house would have been very difficult to conceal. Look for clues in Beth's room. I bet she had a quick way to get to the cellar. Yeah, I'd like the dumb waiter. Hmm. Med kit, huh? Kind of surprising to find that here. What are you looking for? Right then. Um. What's the point of this room? I mean, I can, I can see this part over here. This is a bathroom, obviously. But, like, are these supposed to be massive closets? Hell, oh, I don't even see a sink around here. This place sure is quiet. My little prison for 18 years. I'm certain there's got to be something interesting in here. Something useful. <clears throat> A I wanted pick. to be in the city, but I guess mom thought it was easier to keep her activities secret in the country. Hmm. Well, a lock pick will be helpful, but, uh... Afraid Tracer Tongue may have been wrong. I don't see anything all that useful around here. And sure, let's just have a candy bar that's been sitting around here for years. <clears throat> Seems entirely sanitary. Um... Nicolette? Hello? I think my mother kept a room key behind a little vase up here. Ah, oh, you mean... this one? Okay. Well, that was useful, but uh, I've already had that key. I guess that opened this one somehow? My mom's room. 
And look, her favorite painting. I can't believe the assassins didn't take it. Oh, the hours she would spend just sitting at that table and staring up at her priceless treasure. With her crossbow, flare darts, and shit everywhere. Uh, let me look at those keys again. Okay. Disregard my comment earlier, I misread Nicolette's key as being Beth's key as well. Anyway. Um... Okay. God's sake, it should not be this difficult to be able to actually reach something. see another reload modification <laughs> two seconds <clears throat> or 1.6 seconds uh, three seconds are you telling me it takes more time to reload this thing than it does this Or even the pistol? That doesn't seem right. Upgrades or no. You lead. <clears throat> no idea who's paying for the electricity here, but whoever it is, I'm running up their bill. What am I doing? What am I doing? I need to go back downstairs, but you know what? Let's speed this up a bit. You'll have to go the long way. But what's the point of the ladder being there? I mean, I guess it could be helpful if you uh, left the thing up there and decided you wanted to climb up or something. But uh, other than that, I don't see it. Come on, come on. Oops, I forgot to turn this light on. <clears throat> in France, the gentry keep their wine in a small cellar to preserve the flavor from heat and sunlight. Good to know. Good to know. I guess. Not like uh, the wine storage uh, <clears throat> details are all that useful to me you know I'm curious you crazy or something yep she's invulnerable <laughs> that didn't make sure I was curious about it Now, both of these paths lead to the same area. Okay. Just had to make sure, and I guess I gotta go a long way around because I can't make my way past Nicolette. He just has to stand in the way. Now, let's use this inconspicuous unlit candlestick. It's this completely inconspicuous, not at all suspicious set of wall. Oh, my. This is so well hidden, I'm surprised nobody ever found it. An old bunker, built during World War II by the previous owner to hide Jewish families. The two clans acquired the property after the Nazi city took out in Germany. Strange. A pro tip, uh, pay attention to barrels before you blow them up. That's kind of important. Just put the sword of no I need it out to uh, open this crate. An old bunker built during World War II by the previous owner to hide Jewish families. The Duclairs acquired the property after the Nazis sent him to a camp in Germany. Strange. I'm picking up heavy duty fiber optic activity down here. What's this? A dungeon? 
Something like that. A bit more important, though. And a bit more destroyed by the looks of it. You'll have to find your own way around, I think. Ooh, a law. Hmm. I wonder. Of course, I could just make Nicolette try to walk through everything. That would work. Stop. Fantastic. Stop. We weren't supposed to stand next to it, you fucking moron. Come on. Some kind of giant routing station. Not on any telecom map I've ever seen. Petabytes of transmission. Beth Duclair's probably used it to analyze net traffic. It's a friendly camera. Let's leave it on. Are you done being an idiot? Oh my god. I know. And I've got no space to hold it. God damn it. Hmm. Let's see. What needs it most? 91. 77. 88. That. I have no that. idea. I'm sure you didn't. Flare darts. Ah, this is what I'm looking for. Not so much this. Because, I mean, I'm maxed out on those already, but... Uh, the upgrade canister. And this is, I suppose, interesting just to see what it had. <laughs> now, what could I upgrade? What could I possibly need? This. This... Even though I don't really use it, it strikes me as more important and useful than uh, the other options. Let's just be completely pointless and throw these around. <clears throat> uh, what was that combination again? Be declared Nyko Angel. Is it? A transmission from Morgan Everett. He wants me to go out the back way through the crypt to a nearby cathedral. The Cathedral of the Knights Templar? He didn't say. I'm supposed to access the Majestic 12 computer network. Yes. Majestic 12 controls the place now. They kill the Knights for their gold reserves. Everett must want you to sneak to that part of town through the sewers that connect to our property. I thought the Templars vanished centuries ago. They invented the modern banking system and were its directors, under one name or another, until Majestic 12 took over. He said you had a key. Yes, here it is. The crypt is in the maze behind the chateau. Listen to Everett. He is right to want to avenge the Templars. The Templars inherited the gold of the original French treasury, which was run by a Templar until the order was suppressed. Just before the crackdown in 1307, the gold was secretly moved to a cathedral, where it has remained ever since. The Nazis plundered a third of it during World War II, but most of the gold remains. Let's keep moving. 
Okay, that's good progress for now. I would go on a bit more, but uh, it's late and it's been a rough week. So, <clears throat> that'll be it for now. I accomplished a little bit. Took care of business in the, uh, in the, in Paris. Very nice. Um, well, I'll explore this quickly before ending officially. Um, took care of business in Paris. Uh, made a mess out of a club. And managed to make my way th exploring through this area. And I guess that's the alternate way to get up there. You just... Yeah, yeah, you get into the main room like that. And do, but, uh, Nicolette here will just kind of run against the boards until she somehow makes them explode. Because that's how things work, right? And yeah, made pretty good progress. Um, <clears throat> and uh, next time we will carry on with uh, this part, which is, as mentioned, behind the house. Uh, fairly close by. Um, yeah, like I said, I'd like to carry on more, but I'm tired. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it, and see you next time in Deus Ex. How many sessions has it been since I've been able to actually close one off with that? Wow. <laughs>